The Old Grey Hair is a pretty fabulous Merry Melodies cartoon. This was released in 1944. It's directed by Robert Clampett and we have Mel Blanc as Bugs Bunny and of course we have Arthur Q. Bryan as Elmer Fudd. And it starts off with Elmer Fudd being quite distraught about the fact that he will never capture the rabbit and this voice in the sky I assume is meant to be God tells Elmer Fudd that he shouldn't give up because one day he will be able to catch Bugs Bunny and this voice, God if you like, encourages Elmer Fudd to look far into the future, very far into the future, into the next century and we get to see the sequence played out where Elmer Fudd is a very 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 old man at this point and so is Bugs Bunny. Needless to say, Bugs Bunny would not be alive as a rabbit at this point. But they all have kind of the classic white beard and Bugs Bunny's walking with a cane. And I thought it was very creative and very effective. And then we get to see them as babies. And I won't say any more about that or the comedy that comes from that, but I really thoroughly enjoyed it. I love nap time. I'm not going to say any more about that. I mean that this time, but I loved the nap time bit. It was brief, it was sweet, I absolutely adored it. Baby Bugs and Baby Elmer Fudd are so cute. Seeing them as older as well was wonderful. To be honest, it was a little bit emotional because I've been watching a lot of Warner Brothers cartoons recently and in particular I'm quite a fan of Bugs Bunny and Elmer Fudd cartoons and just to think of them constantly going on this journey with these cartoons lasting for maybe not as long as this suggested but for cartoons being created again and again where they're constantly battling with Bugs Bunny trying to escape and Elmer Fudd trying to capture him. It was just a bit emotional and I actually rather thoroughly enjoyed it. Beautifully animated, really effectively done. If you haven't seen it and you're a fan of Bugs Bunny and Elmer Fudd, definitely check out The Old Grey Hair. I kind of thought it was beautiful and it might not be one of my top five Bugs Bunny cartoons, but it might be one of my top five Bugs with Elmer Fudd. It used the passage of time really effectively, very well animated, quite comedic, really thoroughly enjoyed it.